Hey everyone, welcome back to another YouTube video and you have been requesting a course vlog so you are going to get a course vlog. So unfortunately today it is cart path only and I was being lazy and I took a cart. So we're going to make a little game out of that today because I don't want to be walking all the way to the other side of the fairway from the cart path. So I'm going to see how close I can get it to the cart path on every single hole off the tee. It'll be interesting. I'll probably put myself in some weird places. Hopefully I don't hit it out. That's the goal. I will make it a little bit fun today. So the car path is on the right side, so I'm aiming for the right side of the fairway. close. <laughs> I hit that perfect, but I think I cut it just a little too close. Uh, so I'm playing with fire. Uh, it was very close, which was the objective of this game. I nailed it, but it's kind of scary because I have a feeling I'm going to lose a lot of golf balls by the time this nine holes are done. Uh, but I have 149 to the pin and it's downwind, but I have a bit of a ravine to carry and it plays, kind of plays a little bit longer. So I'm just going to take a seven iron. I'll be good. Um, I hit that perfect. It was right on the pin. Uh, I can't see where it ended up, so we'll, we'll find out soon. Uh, I guess I hit it too good because I flew the green by quite a bit. I uh, just try to get my up and down. Ooh, I broke a lot. I didn't think it was going to move that much. I didn't get my up and down, made bogey. Um, that's like a good lesson for you to know. Is, yeah, it's important to focus on uh, the distance and how far you want to hit your chip shot, but you also need to read the green as if you would for like a putt because I had the perfect distance on that one, but I didn't see how much it was breaking because I didn't take the time to walk up in and read it. And so I had a longer putt than I should have had if I read the break correctly, and then I missed the putt. So take just a little extra time to go up, uh, read the chip shot, see what it looks like it's doing up at the hole, and you'll probably save a ton of shots doing that. side but to be honest um, this is one of the hardest fairways for me to hit visually it just really F's me up because the way it like cuts in and you want to be on the left side but then it's weird on the right it's just such a weird fair fairway especially just like off the tee it's not that it's super narrow it's actually pretty wide when you get there but I think that's what makes desert golf so hard is because <laughs> you literally just see a strip of grass and then desert and if you miss the fairway, you miss the fairway and you're probably not going to find your golf ball. So it's just stressful. So when you have a fairway like this, I like to just pick a target out there and really focus in on my tempo so I don't rush it and then stay committed to the shot so I'm not looking up to seeing where it goes. So I was nowhere near the cart path, but that's a win for this shot. Straight down the center of the fairway and I'll take it. It's one of the harder holes on this golf course and one that I'm happy when I just get away with a par. And that is why we hate cart path only. <laughs> so I have about 204 into this green. Uh, pin is just right in the center. 
and I'm out of breath, <laughs> I need to do more cardio, I'm gonna hit my three hybrid and just go right at it. Uh, just left side, should be okay. Break. Not bad, didn't break as much as I thought. I'll take that floor all day long. Like I said, it's one of the harder holes, and especially since I bogeyed the hole before, um, I wanted to not go on a bogey train, so that was a that was a good par. Car pass on the left side, I naturally just always hit it over there, so I'm not gonna try to do anything different and just hit my normal shot. I'm like pretty close to the car path, so I did exactly what I wanted to do. <laughs> uh, I succeeded again, very close to the car path, uh, but I have 205 yards uphill into the winds. And you guys see me play Troon a lot, so you're probably wondering, like, why are you hitting it so short? I'm not. I'm playing from the tips today. Usually I play from one or two ahead of that. So, of course, a bit long for me, but we're making it work. I'm trying to test my game and uh, get ready. So, here we go. Three wood. I mean, I, I crushed it, but it just like went straight up, looked like it hit a wall. It was right at it, but I think it's gonna be pretty short. <laughs> As expected, I was short, um, but it is what it is. I killed it and I just didn't have enough muscle. So I have a bunker shot now. Uphill lie, when it's an uphill lie, it's gonna add a little bit more loft to your club and make it go a little bit higher. So keep that in mind and just hit a little harder. bunker player um, but it's because I never hit any greens and we have no rigs so we use the foot rig carry and it was a little into the wind and by a little I mean a lot and I barely got to the fairway um, but the bright news I was close to the car path so I think that's a win all around uh, fortunately though normally I can go so it's a split fairway I can normally go for the green um, it's a par five and go to the left side but I clearly didn't hit far enough into the wind so I'm gonna go straight ahead which I never do Um, I drew it, but I actually think I'm going to have a pretty good angle in and it's going to be a shorter shot and I'm close to the cart path again. 
pretty good at this uh, cart path game. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, some of them I'm not really trying, it's just happening, so <laughs> it's good or bad. I have 140 in, into the wind, a little uphill, I'm gonna hit a easy eight. Uh, I think I hit that a bit long, hit it really well, a bit of a flyer lie out of the rough, but uh, we'll see where it ends up. par uh, not too bad but um again we're doing the card pass game and doing that pretty well so I'll take it so we're at a par three now and this is me my last shot that I show for the course vlog hope you guys enjoyed it we had a little fun with uh, the little cart path game, you guys can play this. I don't recommend it because you could potentially lose a lot of golf balls, but it is fun to mix it up and have different targets or games that you can play out on the golf course. And for this par three shot, I am not gonna go for the cart path. I'm gonna try to make a hole in one and hopefully we catch it on camera. <laughs> Unlikely because it's 193 and I'm hitting a hybrid and it's a little windy and it's uh, a right pin on a ridge, but we'll disregard that. Positive thoughts. Another green hit, no hole in one though. I hope you guys enjoyed today's course vlog and don't forget to leave a comment down below, like this video and subscribe to my channel. I'll be putting out more videos and I'll see you guys next Thursday.